Welcome back. Yes, you are back with the West Scarshus and we are in the Great League. Okay, we're matched up against Alola Mantles here. And it's a Powder Snow one, not a charm, so we should be okay for now. I go straight for the move very quick, so we obviously knew that was a weather ball. Rather than a dazzling ring. Now we're gonna get off our psychic here. Yep, that's some decent chunk there. They probably wasn't expecting a psychic. And now they get to another move very quick once again. So they're just going for them weather balls back to back, it looks like. Okay, which is fine with us. Get to our next psychic. And this will do another decent chunk if they decide not to shield. And they don't decide to shield and they go into red before us and they swap out into Mandibus. So we swap out into Galvantula, of course. Uh, let's go. Yeah. Mandibus is tanky, but I don't think it will appreciate these vaults, which is just getting hit up with. Look at them vault switches go, man. Okay, we're going straight for the discharge. Will they think it's a land and decide not to shield? Let's see. Yeah, they shield there. They know. <laughs> they know better. But we're going for the back to back here. So, do they want to give us their second shield? Because that's also fine by us. And yep, we take that second shield too. So if they want to double shield, I guess we're going to double shield. <laughs> Come on. There's literally no point in them double shielding because they, they can't win this matchup. So that was pointless. They're not going to win switch. So yeah, it made no sense doing that. So yeah, we take down the Manda Buzz and they have no shields. We have no shields and they come straight in with their nine tails and throw all energy, which is fine by us. Because like you say, it's just powder snow, it's not charm, so they come straight back in with our ombre and throw our move also. Take down the nine tails and see what they have in the back, because they're two Pokemon down right now. So they come in with Blossom, okay. So we swap out into Medicham so that we can get some ice punches off and do some decent damage. You hear me? Because they got no shields, man. They got no shields. Yeah, that's some decent damage. You can already see where this game's heading. We're comfy, we're comfy. You know the vibes. Feet up on the sofa, kick back. That type of comfy vibes, yeah? And they throw their move back to back. But Medicham is still looking good. Right, this ain't gonna fret him. It's still, it's still Gucci. It's still Gucci. We can just, we didn't even have to throw that. We could have just farmed all the way down. But yeah, I guess we'll make sure. And take that W. And that will be a GG. And you know, we can move swiftly into the next one, man. Because I know that you know the vibes. Okay, so let's move into the next one and see who we match up with. Who they got in the lead? They got Nido Queen. Okay. This is fine with us. A lot of Nido Queen users love to use the shield, so. We'll probably get shields early, and we don't mind this matchup at all either, so. It's fine with us. We'll build up and go for a psychic, but no, they swap out straight away, so we'll swap out <laughs> into our Galvantula, and Galvantula has finally found the Zoom Roll. Zoom Rolls have been hiding. When I didn't have Galvantula on my team, they were everywhere, but look. We got Galvantula, we couldn't find the Zoom Roll, but now we finally cross paths. <laughs> yeah. Galvanched has been hunting you as Zoom rolls down and we finally bumped into you. Finally bumped into you. Yeah. You think you can use a safe 
swap a zoom on us when we got Galvantula. You made the wrong move. <laughs> you made the wrong move. Not much of a safe swap now, huh? Not much of a safe swap now. I dare you to show this. I dare you to show this. It'll be pointless. <laughs> It'll be pointless, but they showed. <laughs> Yeah, right they should. <laughs> Get wrecked, man. Get out of here. These are Zoom roll users. They think using a Zoom roll gives them auto wins. Nah, man. Not when you run into me. Okay. So they need a queen is back. I'm gonna throw the lunge at them. Yeah. And that's good. Good, that's good, that's good. Because now we can, we should be able to come with Umbreon and throw the psychic. They obviously been CMP, so let them throw their move. I don't even think we did, we threw yet anyway. Oh, uh, they threw their move and dipped out. <laughs> that's fine. They think they still have a wink on, do they? Okay, let's see how that works out. <laughs> Scrafty, meet Medicham. <laughs> Oh my god. And they're still trying to fight it out. Fair play to them. Fight till the death, right? Fight it out. But now we don't even need to throw a move at this thing, but we do. And that will take out the Scrafty and that Nido Queen that thought made a good catch. They still have to see us. You still have to see us, and all you're gonna throw right now is a poison thing, not even an earth power. So you're still not threatening. <laughs> Come on, man, get to that psychic, take out the Nido Queen, take the W, and that will be a GG also. These Zoom Roll users make me laugh. But yeah, we had to. You know, hunt down the zoom roll for a while, but when we didn't have Galventula, they were everywhere. <laughs> ah. Okay, into the next one, and it's another a load of nine tails. Will it have charm? This one does have charm. Okay, so we're getting out of there. We swap into Galventula, who also takes damage from charm, but they decide to swap out, so we go for the lunch. They didn't even need to swap out, they could have just shredded us down with that nine toes because Galvantula was getting ripped by that charm but some people when you when you swap they just initially swap also <laughs> but they could have just stayed in but it's okay we're happy with that um and now we can come with Umbreon here and farm up we don't even need to throw straight away we can just Build up some energy if we want. They throw their move, but we we need to farm it down and have some energy ready for that that nine tails that's going to be coming back in because Sham's going to do a lot of damage. So we want to be throwing moves at it, threatening shields so that yeah we're farming all the way down rightfully. So now they should be bringing that nine tails back in. Yeah, and then we throw the cycle get straight away. So now we're going to threaten shields. Huh? Oh, they, didn't, they decided not to show. And we got the defense drop. Let's go. So now we're going to throw another psychic. This will do some nice damage if they decide not to show it. They got two shields, so I'm sure they'll show this. Oh, they don't. They let it go down. Nice. We'll take that. We will take that. Okay. They got Empoleon, and we're throwing the foul player. We're trying to get a shield off of them before we come in with Medicham and just farm it down. <laughs> We're looking good. Now we come with many chairmen. Look at the farm. Look at the farm. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. Let's go. Man. Look at that. Get out of here, man. Oh, wow. Yeah, man. We could two shots flex it, but we know they're throwing drill pack and we fought better of it. <laughs> so, yeah, farm that down. And they died with two shots. They know where that one was heading. GG, man. Cheesy. They played it better, they could have really, really threatened us still, because that 
that um, Alola Nine Tails on the lead with Charm was a bit tricky, but he didn't play it too good. Into the next one, we faced up against a Galvantula. Okay. Okay, now they throw. This is most likely going to be lunge, of course. Yeah, it is. Okay, our attack has fallen. So we probably should have dipped out, but they would have just dipped out, but yeah, it's all right. Okay, I see how it goes. That still does some decent damage for a debuff move. They get to another one before we can get that move off. We can't win CMP against Scalventula, so this will take us down. Okay. We could come in for a mirror, but nah, we're going to go for Medicham, I'm sure. Thinking it out, and yeah, we come in with the Medicham. And then we're going to get debuffed here. We weren't going to win CMP, so there was no point even trying to throw the move. Just going to counter this thing all the way down so that we got energy for whatever's going to come in after. Now they decided to swap because they knew that we were just farming them up and getting a lot of energy off them. So they swap out, we swap out. And what's this going to be? Are we letting it go? No, nope, we showed it's a power whip. And now we can just stack up. Now we've got no shields and they got two shields. So let's see how this one plays out. See if we can get ourselves out of a tricky situation. Okay. We get debuffed and can we get to another move? Of course we can. So debuff them again. Are they going to shield? No, they don't. They still got two shields. Still got two shields, huh? Okay, they're gonna get to a poison thing here. We should still be able to get off a a lunge here. Does some decent damage. Yep, yeah, we get to the lunge. And this Nido Queen's about to get debuffed. And they shield it. Nice, so we swap out. <laughs> Quick combo play. Go for the ice punch. We'll just get another shield. Yep, all right, so now finally all their shields are gone. Nope, you're not gonna catch, mate. <laughs> they didn't keep track of energy well at all. They jumped out way too early, and now we build up and go straight for the psychic. This will do a lot of damage. You might near one shot. Oi, oi, look at that near one shot, and then now we can just counter it down. I mean, even if it's an earth power, we'll survive it. So if it's a poison fang, they've got no chance. And it is just a poison fang, so yeah, that's a GG. <laughs> Nicely played. They had two shields towards the end game. And still we made it out with a W. That's a GG, man. Okay, so we're moving into the next one. Okay, Skarmory. Faced up against the Skarmory, we have Umbreon on the lead, of course. And we don't mind this matchup at all. We don't mind it. Umbreon's gonna put in some work. And they're throwing their first move, which is gonna be a Sky Attack, I'm sure. Yes, it is. And we're building up, and now we're gonna go for our first our play here. Go. Oh, it gets a shield. I'm not too sure why they shielded that, but it's fine with us. Okay, now we get off the next one. And we're thinking, should we shield? Because they shielded. And we do shield. I'm going to threaten and see what the reason is behind them shielding. We got chilling at the back. Or did they just want to switch? Who knows? Okay. Get to another move. Yes, I'm gonna take it out. That's if they don't decide to shield her. They might want to give us a second shield. I don't see the point though, but let's see. 
Yeah, we take them down here and they go a shield down. We go a shield down. No, we level one shields and in the back they got Ferrothorn. Fine with us. Okay, and they would TMP. We're not going to be able to throw the move here. We're going to go down. That's fine. Should be able to come in with Medicham here and just farm it down. Or we can come with Galvantula either way. But we decided to come in with Medicham. So Medicham can just farm this thing down without taking much damage. So it was the better play. Normally I wouldn't want to have Galvantula left alone in back though. Because you never know. They could have a, something like a Bastard on him back. But they have the Oxy. So they're looking good. Because we're going to get to a lunge here. But the Oxys has got Psycho Boost and it's got Rock Slide, which even after debuffing it, might still take out our Garbantula, but we won't mind. We can even just let it go here. But we decide to shield it up. Yep. And now that... <laughs> now... Their attack has harshly fallen, so they're going to be barely doing anything now. So now we can farm them down. Yeah, that, that doesn't do much. So we can just farm them all the way down. They messed up doing that. And they top left. That's a GG. Thank you guys for coming around once again, though. That was the last battle. Take care, guys. Peace.